Hi guys, this is your host Tom Strong, and in this video I'm gonna review. Uh, actually, it's not a review, but uh, just a small overview of the the Petamolis faction, which is a a new faction in Zero AD. Just gonna. run over the units and uh, check which ones are special units, which ones are used in other factions. Um, hopefully this will give you um, just a small taste of this of this uh, faction. Uh, it seems to be uh, th there will be a, a strong opponent in multiplayer games because we have the, the siege tower and uh, the tower of war elephant which are pretty strong units especially in late games also I noticed that in these um, these version of the game uh, the farms have a new three-dimensional model which uh, adds a lot of a bit of eye candy to the game uh, this faction has um, a new model for the farm stack here we also have the storehouse the barracks I think that this uh, model is used from other faction, I don't know. The house certainly are new. I never seen them before. Uh, here we have the temple. Oh, where yeah. we can um, yes, see? produce Egyptian priests. As Rato. you can see I have uh, three of them here. Uh, the market. Uh, I think it's the same as the Missyodians model. But yes, we see? have the traders which are special units. Just camels. It's interesting. The corals are, I think that they are used for another faction. But the temple is new. I hope. It's called Temple of Edfu. The defense towers uh, are interesting. Check it out. I'm gonna do a, a rotation. The walls um, are used from other faction. The castle is new. Yeah, looks interesting. Yes, D. Russell. I'm gonna make an overview of the, the units which can produce on the castle. So you can produce the champion melee cavalry spearman, which is called the King's Guard Cavalry. We also have the Tower of the Elephant, as we've seen before, the Bolt Shooter, the Bolt, the Siege Catapult, and the Siege Tower. One thing interesting in this faction is that you can build. Um, is a military settlement in neutral territory. Uh, and with this building you can uh, produce three units. The Mali the Gallic Settler Swordsman, which is a Mali infantry swordsman. Yes, yeah, I believe this unit is uh, used in other factions already. Uh, for sure. You also can produce the, the Macedonian Settler Cavalry and um, the Tarantine Settler Cavalry. Yep. I'm just gonna end up this video with uh, two more uh, strange buildings which oh, have uh, yeah. which have, uh, some depth to this faction. We, we have the Lighthouse. I'm gonna yes, just read the description for the Lighthouse. Uh, where you can build along the shore to reveal the shorelines over the entire map and have a very large vision range which is not yet implemented we also can build uh, the library which you, re you can research special technologies and reduce the research time of all rem remaining technologies uh, also one of the things that I uh, I didn't mention already is that you can build houses for free. I'm gonna just uh, select this woman and 
as you can see we don't have a uh, oh my god we don't have uh, a wood cost the farmstead and the storehouse in the house don't have actual resource costs you can just build them the yeah, downside no. is that they require more time to yes, build. Yes, Russell. The boats all seem... Uh, standard. Check. We have the heavy warship and uh, the juggernaut warship. Well, I think uh, I haven't forgotten anything. Nope. So again, this is not a uh, the final version of the faction. Hopefully, there will be more more tweaking and also some new models. Uh, this faction looks really amazing. Uh, but um, well, but nothing. I really don't have anything to add. So um, hopefully, I will uh, upload some videos with this faction in multiplayer games and um, just to see the the strengths and the weakness of 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 uh, of this faction. Hope you guys uh, subscribe to see these videos later and see you soon.